welcome back uh, two days ago I created a video showing the instant power display on the on the dash and the, you know, the figures were hard to be readable so I decided to make a, a new video showing you guys really the, the details on the screen uh, this time Still setting up the aircon, stuff like that. And uh, now what I want to do is do some full power accelerations and some brakes session, either uh, using the, the normal brakes or regular brakes, where you can see that the regular brake is actually using uh, recuperation, so regenerative uh, braking. And the same thing for the for the pedal on the steering wheel. So if you full long press the, the left pedal on the steering wheel, the car will come to a full stop. And then you did 100% of the braking just on the motor. There's no dash cam running this time. This is just a test to see if uh, you can see the display well uh, using my suction cup that is actually hanging off the, the sunglasses uh, holder on the ceiling of the car. And from the looks of it, yeah, it's a bit wobbly but could be the optical stabilization of the camera as well. So it's a small Nikon camera, an action cam with optical zoom and I think also optical stabilization. So we drive into a speed governed zone. Aircon is on. And with 8, 9, 10 kilowatts, you could drive on a normal road using uh, a highway with, with just 80 kilometers an hour. So just 10 kilowatts needed. Who needs this 150 kilowatts, right? small uh, incline and decline where you see uh, the power going negative here the power goes up again we're almost out of the speed governed zone so we're going to floor it again I hope the camera sticks on It's a bit tricky, these suction cups. Camera is small but not the lightest. It's one of these uh, Nikon AW130s. You can use it underwater. The colors are pretty good. Um, let's see. A little bit of acceleration. behind a regular car on a flat road Looks like the refresh of the display is one second per tick. 
I'm actually driving to a electronics shop to uh, buy myself a new Android phone so I can do some data logging using Torque Pro and a Bluetooth uh, adapter. So I can show you guys some more detailed power curves while driving my uh, my standard drive to work. Acceleration again. This you really need a, a stop and go uh, road where you drive from traffic light to traffic light. cars around me at that uh, stopping light where I just departed from and uh, <laughs> looks like they're still there. <laughs> I 
I like I really like the speed of this car I want to do some uh, actual drag racing with uh, my former car see if this car is really as quick as it feels prove to myself that it's it is actually an upgrade so we're driving into the parking garage so we'll stop the video soon okay thanks for watching and talk to you later